here we have created our user form and first of all we need to check for a valid username that user to insert here so every username should unique for this we need to just check whether this username exists or not for this we will make a just request so open your registration called file and in in user input box we will create a id called username and we can make a script for our ajax function here in the script we can just uh, call a function when the username input box will change so we can take the id of the username and just call the function on change so whenever it will change it will call this function like here we can check it whether it to working or not uh, if i uh, if i the base insert something here it's okay it's working so it's uh, working well and now we need to store the username value to a variable we can take a variable like where username is just to id of the username dot well so we have the value and now we need to create a, a ajax file that will provide us the information for the username existence so first of all we will create a folder like ajax and uh, all the file related to ajax we will insert in this file so we can create a file here check valid username.php and in check valid username.php we just need to check whether this username exists or not and here put this ok and if is set post username if username exists then we will store it in a variable username as a real escape string post username so we have username we can just echo like this here is our username is just to you can just echo it for to check it is working or not and in the script the script we just need to execute it so we can just use a simple function called post and the the address of our ajax file is ajax slash check valid username dot php and the parameter we need to send like username and after execution the function uh, after execution the process will execute this function and the output this data so we can make the alert for this data so we will know whether it's working or not just if there is the page here you can it is santosh it is give the error my should escape exact to so we have an error in our script now so in our ajax file what we have error we didn't took the variable con okay again here i insert santosh okay here you can see here is our username santosh so it's good now we have the information here so just remove this echo line here we don't want it okay so now we will check whether this username exists or not for this you can directly check for by doing the code query my sqli query con select 
select uh, select 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 username from we have here the name is user where where username is goes to username if my school i now rows query is greater than 0 okay is equal to equal to 0 it means the new username is is okay so we can take a echo 1 else echo 0 if we add the 1 it means it it is it is okay either it will invalid so if we can check here just uh, let's try the page here if, if i here insert some tools it will have one but we already have the username admin so just insert here admin and it says this username is already exist so we can just show this information here so we can do it by providing information here like uh, we can make a uh, text area here or we can make just a uh, simple space here mm, what we can do we can make a id uh, called username status and it's empty and what will happen we will check if data equal to equal to one what we will do is that in our username status dot html will change to this is a valid username okay else as invalid is the name so we have done here if i here is a santos it shows this is a valid is a name and if i insert here admin invalid is a name okay it's done